Speed, I am Speed. Are you a car enthusiast wanting to purchase a new electric vehicle? Do you enjoy learning about the latest developments in electric vehicles? Do you want to own the most recent electric vehicle models? Xpeng Motors announced the addition of its second SUV, the Xpeng G9, to its product lineup in November 2021. The G9 is the brand's fourth model, and it's larger and more advanced than the Xpeng G3i, which was unveiled at Auto Guangzhou 2021. It's a seven-seater that's electric and modern. It's a G9 SUV that'll be available both in and outside China. We know about the Tesla Model Y competitor Xpeng G9, nice crossover, set to debut later this year. The Xpeng G9 resembles the Xpeng P7 sedan in appearance. It has a full-width, ultra-slim DRL strip on top, separate headlights with two LiDAR sensors, a smooth mask instead of a standard radiator grille, a mesh pattern lower air intake, and an artistically designed bonnet. The G9 features a streamlined greenhouse, well-designed door panels with smooth surfacing and flush-fit handles, and hefty 5-spoke 21-inch alloy wheels from the sides. The G9 has full-width tail lamps and blocked lettered X-Peng lettering at the back, similar to the P7. The tail lamps appear to be more significant on the SUV, though. The X-Peng G9 will be the first to showcase a new brand logo. Existing models such as the G3i, P5, and P7 will embrace the new brand identity beginning in the year's second half. X-Peng G9 test mules were recently discovered, testing many times around Europe, where the firm intends to expand. The prototype was parked at Matosinos near Porto, Portugal, and was well camouflaged. X-Peng G9 was spotted in Europe. On May 2, 2022, Motor.es reported that an X-Peng G9 prototype was tested on Spanish roads. We can confirm that the exact vehicle in Spain was also seen sporting the temporary registration plate in Portugal. The design aspects are identical to the official photos of the X-Peng G9, except for the prototype's alloy wheel design, which appears to be unique. X-Peng could be wrapping up final tests on the electric SUV and preparing it for a European launch with minor tweaks. Interior On March 27, 2022, more inside spy images surfaced on CN Beta, clearly showcasing the X-Peng's G9's dashboard layout. A large digital cluster, essential infotainment screen, and a third screen for the co-driver take up a lot of digital real estate up front. Two beverage containers and two wireless smartphone charging techs are located in the central console. Under the center console, there looks to be more storage space, USB Type A and C charging connections, and a 12-volt power plug. In comparison to the X-Bank P7, the screen arrangement is different. A single panel houses two screens, one for the instrument cluster and the other for entertainment. X-Bank has taken the G9 one step further by including a third screen. There are notable characteristics of two-spoke steering with actual touch buttons, ambient lighting, and an upright windscreen. During the brand's quarter four 2021 earnings call, CEO He Xiaopeng stated that the G9 would be a five-seater medium to large-size SUV. Even as options, six- and seven-seater combinations would not be available. Platform x Motors wants to expand its footprint in China's mid-to-high segment electric vehicle industry. The x G3 is a small SUV, and the x G9 is a large SUV. The company's David platform enables the production of electric vehicles with wheelbases ranging from 2,600 to 2,800 millimeters. The Edward platform is designed for large cars with 2,800 to 3,100 millimeter wheelbases. The David platform is home to the x G3 and x P5, while the Edward platform is home to the x P7 and x G9. Performance and Range For the time being, x claims that the G9 is equipped with the company's new-generation X-Power 3.0 powertrain technology in China's first 800-volt mass production SIG platform. The G9 has a peak DC charging capability of up to 480 kilowatts, and a 5-minute charge will give it a range of up to 200 kilometers. The electronic and electrical architecture is XEEA 3.0. The new x SUV's top-end version could include a twin-motor AWD powertrain with at least 316 kilowatt of power and a 655 newton meter of torque capable of going from 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in less than 5 seconds. A WLTP range of more than 500 kilometers is expected. According to a CN EV Post article, Sunwoda's 4C power cells will be used in one of the G9's battery packs. According to the research, 4C could be too short for a 15-minute quick charge. According to the study, x Motors stated when introducing the G9 that it could hold a 100 kilowatt hour battery pack with a power density of 2.2 kilowatt per kilogram. According to the source, 
Senwoda will be the key supplier in one of the G9 configurations, contributing more than half of the material. Xpeng Motors, for one, has dismissed claims that it's switching suppliers. Features Xpeng Motors has revealed that the G9 will come with Xpilot 4.0, 5G connection, software OTA updates, and 21-inch wheels. The G9 is the company's first model with Xpilot 4.0 and China's first model with gigabit Ethernet connections. From vehicle startup to parking, Xpilot 4.0 will provide full scenario-assisted driving. Thanks to the gigabit Ethernet networking architecture, a firmware OTA upgrade can take as short as half an hour thanks to the gigabit Ethernet networking architecture. Xpeng Motors obtains the LiDAR for the Xpeng P5 from Dajiang Innovations, a Chinese business known for drones and abbreviated as DJI. During the quarter 1 2021 earnings conference call, he, Xiaopeng, co-founder, chairman, and CEO of Xpeng Motors, hinted that the LiDAR for the new Xpeng SUV could come from another business. Xpilot 4.0, based on new hardware architecture, will significantly improve perception capabilities and provide full scenario driver assistance. Xpeng Motors' driver assistance system will feature 508 TOPS ECU computing capacity in its fourth edition. The new hardware will include two NVIDIA Drive Orin Autonomous Driving SoCs, an 8 million pixel front view binocular camera, and 2.9 million pixel side view cameras in a highly integrated and extendable domain controller. On a related point, Xpeng Motors is also working on Xpilot 5.0. The fifth version will mark the transition from advanced assisted driving to autonomous driving. The overall structural design of Xpilot 5.0 has been completed, but we don't expect a commercial launch for another two years. Meets International Standards The G9, according to Xia Heng, co-founder and president of Xpeng Motors, is the company's first model designed from the start with international markets in mind. According to Heng, it'll be in charge of its brand development and expansion. During the product development, the corporation considered the tastes and needs of international markets in terms of design and other features. During the development of the G9, Xpeng Motors kept worldwide safety standards in mind. The new electric SUV meets the strict EU WVTA vehicle certification standards and the CNCAP and ENCAP 5-star safety design standards. Chinese automobiles improve safety with each new model. In NEO's ES8, which achieved a 5-star Euro NCAP safety rating in September 2021, is an example. For the G9, Xpeng Motors should aim for the highest possible score. Using environmentally friendly components in automobiles is a beautiful move, but what happens to the car at the end of its life is an increasing problem. The G9, according to Xpeng Motors, meets the EU 3R certification requirements. It can be reused over 85% and recycled over 95%. Xpeng G9 Release Date The Xpeng G9 was supposed to debut at the Beijing Auto Show in April 2022. The G9's debut date was unknown due to the show's extended postponement until Xpeng posted a few posters on social media implying a new launch date, according to Geech, on April 8, 2022. The order book was supposed to open at the Beijing Auto Show, but June will be the new deadline. Customer deliveries may begin in the second part of this year, with small-scale deliveries in August and large-scale deliveries in September. During the brand's quarter 4 2021 earnings conference call, CEO He Xiaopeng said, that the pilot production vehicle had successfully rolled off the line, with launch date planned for the third quarter of 2022. The European debut of the Xpeng G9 is expected to happen a few months after the Chinese market introduction in markets such as Norway. The G9, Xpeng's flagship product introducing the new brand identity, might cost roughly 250,000 yen after subsidies. That would put it below the Tesla Model Y, which starts at 276,000 yen after subsidies. The Xpeng G9 is the electric car of the future. It has the potential to revolutionize the automobile industry. Electric vehicles are also a part of the present. It is China's first automobile to succeed in the global market.